launch control. This is Houston. We are uh, go for launch. Hey, this is just a quick episode, Lessons Learned from the Model Rocket Controller Project. My buddy, who I designed it for, has been using it the last couple of years with the Scouts and has noticed some issues uh, with regards to using larger Estes engines, like engine size E. Um, I want to draw your attention to the original schematics. This is the second page, which shows a lot of the wiring, um, external wiring. Uh, this is, if we draw our attention to R27 and R28, you'll see here, these are the clips that go out to the igniter for the rocket. R27 and R28 are 6 ohm 50 watt resistors. And I put them in there to limit the current to about 2 amps, depending on your voltage source. And it does seem as though, the, though those larger Estes engines require more than that for a very short period of time. So I'm not going to change the schematic. I think this is kind of up to you if you want to leave them in place or not. However, I'm going to remove them on the original uh, project and I'm going to take you over to the bench just to show you how to do that. It's not at all hard as you can imagine. But um, with that, this will allow him to launch the larger engines. So let's head over to the bench. So these are the two uh, 6 ohm 50 watt resistors. So what we're going to do first is just do a quick test. We're going to see um, how many amps we do get out of it when we fire it. The pad is clear. The range is clear. Weather clear. Launch control, this is Houston. We uh, go for launch. Okay, so we're about 1.9 amps. So what we're going to do is remove those uh, resistors now and see what kind of current we can get out of it. So the simplest way to get rid of these two safety resistors is just to cut the wire on each side, put it together. That's all there is to it. So now we'll retest it. See what we get. Okay, everything looks like it's blinking now. We've got continuity. We have a scrub. Okay, so now we're going to clear it. We're going to go through the first step. The pad is clear. Second the range step. is clear. Third step. Weather clear. Okay, so we can launch. Let's make sure we got the camera. On the amp meter. Launch control, this is Houston. We uh, go for launch. Okay, here we go. And we have launch. Looks like we got about nine amps out of it that time. That should be more than enough to uh, to launch those Estes rockets. So, there we go. Should be fixed now. All right. Learn something new every day, guys. Take care.